Hey there, it's Rob, the Ignorant Entrepreneur, and I want to talk about ChatGPT by OpenAI. This thing has been revolutionary. It's changing the way people are doing everything, to be honest with you. And a lot of people, of course, are looking for little business opportunities and things like that, myself included. But then you also have the ability to improve code that's available. And it's to the point where even proprietary language like that with uh, TradingView's PineScript, you can make alterations or have ideas suggested for that. So it's an incredible tool for me. And I've heard people describe it as actually being the evolution of Google. And so I wanted to make this video to basically reinforce that Google's management has reportedly issued a code red with the rising popularity of ChatGPT. So Sundar Pichai, hope I didn't butcher that name, the CEO of Google and its parent company Alphabet has participated in several meetings around Google's AI strategy and directed numerous groups in the company to refocus their efforts on addressing the threat that ChatGBT poses in its search engine business. Now, this is according to an eternal memo and audio recording reviewed by The Times. In particular, teams in Google's research, trust and safety division, among other departments, have been directed to switch gears to assist in the development and launch of AI prototypes and products. And this is really smart because, yeah, I'm looking at Google as the ability to find different links and specific businesses. But chat GPT right now is going to be able to give you certain ideas. So if you're asking a question like, how do I get in shape or I need to create a schedule for myself to be successful at this or I'm trying to start this business, what are the steps to take? And then I can go further into those steps and start to break it down. The more specific questions you ask ChatGPT, the better answers you're going to get. If you ask generic questions, you're going to get generic answers. So it's just been me testing around with it this past week. And yes, I have implemented it into my coding or strategy development process, but I also trying to figure out different ways that I can apply it in everyday life and for new business ideas. Let me know what you guys think. The evolution of Google or will Google come out and beat them at their own game because they have a lot more data. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. This has been The Ignorant Entrepreneur. I'm out.